Well, I wasn't really expecting to film this video, especially since I have been absent for a little bit, but yeah, it, it's definitely not going to be an easy one to film. I, I won't film this video for too long because I know that I just need a little bit of time to reflect and just basically just remember and this is something that I, I I'm really struggling to let go just after Christmas I lost a very 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 good friend and it came so unexpectedly and so out of the blue that I just couldn't bear myself to think or do the things I would normally do. I just really couldn't cope. All I did was just stare at my bedroom wall, trying to make sense of what's going on. And even though I'm slowly, slowly getting the bearings of myself, I, I'm, I'm still trying to move on but the feeling of the pain that's in my heart it's really struggling to let go so here we go so just around that time just after Christmas I received some very very sad news and the sad news was that Andy who most of you know who has a YouTube channel called Indie Andy, well, he died. He died just after Christmas. And I'm so heartbroken, I really am. Andy was a great guy who had the biggest heart of gold and he had a legacy of being a person who has done extraordinary things for the for the autism and for the YouTube communities as well. He was very passionate about the things that he had done, not just um, like talking about the current issues affecting the community that he loved talking about, such as Pokemon and Star Wars. And. It, it it was I'm sorry it was I, I really cannot find the words to speak now I really can't his kindness and his personality always brought so many joy to people's lives including mine and I know that being friends with Andy and doing various collaborations and meeting him and his wife Nicola in person a few years ago I knew that Andy he was always a sociable guy and he he always always never failed to make people smile he was always inclusive and he was like he he was always brave he never shared a moment that if he felt something wasn't right he would say that and would stand up for the, the autism community and he did really great things he really did i'm thinking in my thoughts and prayers of nicola and these family, friends, and everyone that knew Andy as well. He will be forever missed. And even though he is no longer here, but even, and only with us in spirit and in our heart, I just want to tell Andy, thank you so much. Andy, Thank you so much for being such a wonderful friend to all of us, to everyone in the communities that you have touched the lives to. Honestly, you've touched the lives of so many people 
and lots of them, they are extremely, extremely grateful for your kindness, your inclusion, and your positive enthusiasm as well. So, yeah, thank you. Thank you so much for everything that you've done. Thank you for being my friend. And most important, importantly, thank you just for being you. Until then, Andy, stay you, stay indie. And thank you so much for everything you have done.